If you've ever hooked an MP3 player, your iPhone, other electronic devices to a larger speaker, you've probably noticed that you didn't have enough power to drive those speakers adequately uh, and probably had some distortion and extremely low volume. You can correct that problem with a fairly inexpensive small amplifier that you can put between your device and the speakers. I sell these. They run $9.99, uh, relatively inexpensive, and uh, do a fair job. You'll need, of course, the amplifier, your device, your speakers, a patch cable to go from your device to the speaker, uses a 3.5, and a power supply. Uh, today we're going to use just a simple AC adapter. It's a little underpowered. Uh, this is rated for up to 2 amps. You can also use a much larger power supply, something like this, that will give you a little more volume, especially if you're driving bigger speakers yet. We'll start out by connecting the patch cable. Simply plugs into the, to the amplifier. and into your phone device, mp3 player, whatever. You'll have, I've already determined which is positive on this uh, power supply. And on the board, it will be labeled 12 volt positive and negative. Simply take the positive and slide it under the positive screw. under the negative. And you will also have uh, left channel, right channel, and it will be labeled ne negative and positive. Take your left speaker side and your right speaker to the right side See the, the electrical connections that I've made. I'll try to get it closer. Again, left, right, power, and your connection to your device. We'll plug in the AC adapter. Ah, huh, we must have power. The blue light came on. And we'll go to and I'm not I was not turning the volume up very high you can turn it to extremely low As small as these speakers are, I do not want to crank the amplifier up high because I will blow the cones out of them. But uh, as you can see, there's, there's quite a bit of volume, considerably more than there would have been hooking it directly to the, uh, the device. Hope that answers your questions. If you have any more, get a hold of me. Uh, I'm on the web. 
www.driveinmfg.com. Appreciate you taking the time to watch my video.